Hello, I'm Mark Davis with the Wesco Automation Sales Group. Today we're going to demonstrate how to uh, terminate an industrial Ethernet cable with the Siemens Fast Connect tool and Siemens Fast Connect components. The connectors come in three different designs, uh, one being the 180 degree uh, straight through connector which I'm holding in my hand here. Another option you have is the 145 degree angled outlet. You can see how it's angled here. This would be something you may use on the Simotions product or Synamics drive products. The third connector we have here is a 90 degree and you can see it definitely comes out as a 90 and we would probably use this on one of our ET200S products. Okay, so why don't we get started. The first thing you're going to need is a Siemens Industrial Ethernet Fast Connect stripping tool like this. Uh, you're going to need, we're going to terminate a straight connector today right here and you'll need some industrial ethernet cable. The first thing you're going to do is you need to know the part number of your connector and you'll see here on the side it has different strip lengths for different part numbers, okay? So we know that the first, our, our strip length is this very top one here. So we're going to lay the cable down along the stripper. We're going to hold this up against our finger here. I'm going to clip down once, turn, and then I'm going to click down another time and turn. That's it. Undo it. This piece will come off. I like to have a pair of cutters around because it makes this little piece coming off a little easier. And there's a little piece of plastic on there and this little white center piece will get rid of that. Get rid of the plastic. And now we're going to fan the colors out. All right. Inside the connector, you're going to notice there is a color code. So this is going to be orange, blue, yellow, and white. Okay. So we need to get these guys in order. So I fanned them out. So they're white, yellow, blue, and orange. I'm going to take them slide them into the connector. This thing has a vamp power clamp on the back side. We're going to push down on it. Make sure that the thing is rotated so you can get your cable down in there. We're going to clamp that down there and then we're going to rotate it. This has a little slot where you can put a screwdriver in to lock it down. So now you have a completed industrial ethernet cable ready to plug in to your hardware. So once again, here's the finished product. For all part numbers, for connectors, um, stripping tools, please see the end of the YouTube video. Uh, once again, if you have any questions, do not hesitate to uh, call the Wesco Industrial Automation Group, and um, have a great day.